Welcome back, everybody, to Imperion Galactic Survival Alpha 8.7. I'm an old guy gaming. And we are going to, excuse me, we're going to continue uh, working here on getting this Ascosium. But we have a bunch of enemies surrounding us. There's a couple guys over there. Um, if you uh, saw the last episode, I had to log off because the server was doing a restart. So basically, this is where we left off. Uh, and then, of course, we have a storm coming, too. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and... I cut the power on the whoops wrong key mining vessel and I'm going to go into here and pull this turret out but we're also we're gonna jump out of here and we're gonna very quickly run up into the J jet and uh, take the enemies out that are in the immediate vicinity with the J jet and then I'm gonna put the turret on the miner for the next round of enemies that might show up okay here we go Oh, get up there quick, 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 quick. Phew, okay. Well, one of them fired at us, but uh, we managed to get in here, I think, without getting hit. It hit one of the ships. I still don't understand why these guys don't fire on the ships themselves, though. It just doesn't seem... Weird. I mean, it does seem weird. It doesn't seem like it's the way they should do it. So let's kill these guys, particularly, you know, with me shooting at them like I'm doing. I'm trying to get a beat on this guy. Let's get a little closer. Um, you know, because some of these guys carry rockets, and you think at least the rocket guys... <laughs> I can't get a shot off of that guy. Uh, you'd think at least the rocket guys would fire on, a, you know, on an enemy vessel or something. Takes care of him. There's a dude right here. Let's put him out of our misery. Okay. And then we got some uh, mech dudes over here and some other these guys. Less steeper angle here. Go with the mechs. I think that's just important. Okay. Alright, do we have more patrols in the very immediate vicinity here? see with the trees and all that. Yeah, we got some more dudes. Okay, let's take this guy out. Oh wow, okay, we got the overseer, overlord seer dudes right here. might be um, Earth-like. It's definitely uh, not a safe place unless I just happen to land in the area where you know the aliens patrol. Because we do have these on Dallas too, these patrols. Maybe the game puts them around all the Zascosium in a restroom deposits too. That's, could be. It's a possibility. That definitely thins them out a little bit. I don't know if it got every single one of them, but... There was a bunch that were down here in the in the mine, too. I don't know if they, they're still in there, if they came out. I don't see... Anyone down there? You know what? We could... 
could do just to be on the safe side, though, is let's uh, send a volley down there. <laughs> it's getting a little froggy out. Uh, yeah, that's a guy too, right? Yeah. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to hop back in the miner now. I know I haven't gotten every single one of them, but we definitely thinned them out quite a bit. And we're going to pop the turret on the miner. Get right to the front there. We'll pop the turret on the miner. And then the turret will hopefully take, take care of any more... Uh, that we run into here so let's get the turret I want to put it right about whoa that's not exactly where I wanted to put it but let's run out here real quick and get inside of here power this thing up and then we're gonna go to the turret Um, set this turret to not to only do aliens. Okay. Yeah, I know that's positioned weird, but they didn't really give me much choice. What we'll try and do though is reposition it once um more or less clear in this immediate vicinity. Let's go. I don't know if those overseers will be a problem for us or not. Let's see if we can take this guy out. Yeah, the auto targeting wants to take out those guys first. Now he's going after the mech. Oh, okay. Somebody is shooting at me. Interesting. Why now? <laughs> why, why are you shooting at me now and not before? I don't know. There's enemies all over the place. Oh my goodness, look at all those mechs over there. Alright, you know what? Let's um let's take control of this turret ourselves. Because that way we can be a little more efficient. Here. I got a guy right here. Overseer group. What the hell is that thing? Oh. That's the, the stems on that uh, flower. All right. <clears throat> Something did actually shoot at us, which I found a little interesting there. Let's get back in the ship here. I'm still shooting at something way over that way. What are you shooting at, man? Oh, there was a guy over by that tree. Okay. 
right, let's see if um we can finish our mining now. I'm just gonna leave the turret where it is for the moment. What we might actually do here too is come back around here. I'm fairly concerned about getting stuck with the lasers. It's more of a concern when you're using the mechanical bullets. This is going to be a nice um, boat of task force for sure. Let's go down here to get this lower one. Well, we keep up well as much as we can. Keep a little bit of that upper area so we can get out easy. Turn around and get this last little node. Which is right down here. And is that it? Come on, <clears throat> you can do it. Level out, buddy. I don't have, I don't have very much reverse, very powerful reverse thrust on this thing. Finished uh, that one out, so we're good to go there. Let's go right on over and hit this restroom, since it's right here. It looks to me like it might make the most sense to approach it from here, maybe? Turn around about right here. Guys, some people call them dogs, but I, I think they look like bats. Myself. So we'll get the ones on the top first. Get closer to the surface, I guess I should say. Yeah, I like, I like my little camel rider. It's um, very similar to the lady, ladybug design. So it's not super original, but it's not exactly the same as ladybug though either. I built it on the multiplayer server originally. And, it, and I did build it, you know, from scratch too. It wasn't something that... Uh, was a ladybug going to modify. Not that that would have been that hard to do. Okay, so now we're going to have to go deeper. Now we are going to have to go deeper. So let's cut over into here. We'll get all this 
get the nose down far enough to get these nuts out of the way. That will help. And it's temperate, so it would be a potential future home for us if we wanted it. I like that well enough. And it's got all these deposits of the best ores. So it just kind of goes to show that you always want to check everything because I would never would have guessed that this place would have these ores. It for this deposit. Got a lovely radiation storm going on. I believe so. I believe we got that. Nice. Okay. Let's go ahead and park this first and then we'll jump off and grab the J jet. Maybe we'll luck out in the next the next uh, deposit that we find will not have uh, camped by so many damn aliens. I'm gonna turn her this way too. Okay. How are we doing on ammo? Down to 583. So yeah, we might. What we might want to do in this case, here, let's redo all that too. Is we might want to actually disable this turret for now. So that we can, um, <clears throat> you know, fire it ourselves so it's not wasting a bunch of ammo. And while we're still kind of in a hostile place, I'm not going to. Um, Worry about repositioning. We just need to get out of here and and go somewhere else. So here we go, hopping out. And we're gonna just quickly run down to the big jet here. Hop inside. Good enough. Got the thrusters there. And let's get out of this area. I wonder if that ramp's going to give me problems when we leave, when we try and get back out. Wrong button. Sweet. Okay. I didn't count uh, how much we actually got, but uh, we got a pretty good haul out of that, uh, for sure. So, I guess what we'll do, ugly, ugly radiation storm. Nasty, nasty. I guess what we'll do is, we were kind of on an easterly heading until we found stuff on the scanner, so let's, let's just kind of continue that uh, easterly heading here. And yeah, we'll keep going this way until we find a scanner.
or find something on the scanner rather, to go investigate. It's like flying through pea soup. Nasty. Well, I'll tell you what I'll probably do, guys, particularly since you can't see very well anyways. I think I'll cut the camera here until we find uh, the next deposit, and then I'll bring you back at that point. Okay? I'll be right back. All right. We're back, everybody. Uh, so I just spent, I don't know, probably the last hour, hour and a half maybe, uh, and pretty much I just uncovered the whole dang planet. And I bookmarked all the um, deposits and uh, points of interest that I wanted to bookmark. And uh, so, yeah, now pretty much know where everything is. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go into uh, this large deposit, which is right next to the admin station, and mine that out. And then I think that's all we're going to do uh, for now on, on this planet here. And we'll definitely be coming back here later, uh, you know, because this is just a gold mine, basically, of resources for um, those high-level ores. Uh, one thing I will say about this planet, though, is even though it's, um, you know, a temperate planet, Earth-like, I tell you what, man, the weather has been crap this in almost entire time I've been here. Uh, I left when I left you guys, we had a big nasty radiation storm, and then it's pretty much just been raining and fogging almost the entire time. So I don't know if this is such a paradise or not. <laughs> but anyway, uh, let's go ahead and come on down here, and we're going to uh, tap into this Zast deposit. I'm hoping that uh, we don't have. A bunch of nasty ground patrols this time like we did last time so we'll come right over to oh well so much for that there are a bunch of nasty ground patrols down there aren't there dang it okay well we're gonna have to deal with them then again so let's see um just trying to see yeah there's patrols right there too there's a spot we can go that's sort of clear of these guys. So they're not shooting at me as soon as I jump out of the, the ship. Maybe what we'll do is we'll come here and we'll just flip around and land right about here. And then I'm going to jump in the J-Jet and clear out the majority of those dudes before we um, get in the miner. So let's go ahead and hop out of here and jump up into here. Uh, we did take some very minor damage uh, from a couple of POIs while we were out and about there. I want to make sure that this thing is not damaged. Yeah, it is actually damaged a little bit. Wrong button. Wrong button there, dude. So we'll put it back down. And uh, I guess that healed it up. It's kind of cheesy that you can do that. You shouldn't, you shouldn't be able to pick it up if it's damaged, but I don't know. I know other games like Ark uh, can be that way too, where they won't let you pick something up until it's completely healed. Well, actually, you might, maybe it is an Ark. Maybe I'm thinking of it. Any hosel. Let's go ahead and head over here and take out these enemies so we can mine this Zast deposit. Then we should be in pretty good shape uh, for Zaskosium after we take care of these guys. And we'll go on back home and then we'll continue our build. Because I want to get that build done so we can start actually using our ship and enjoying it. Don't necessarily have to get it done before the next major release because you know we'll just carry it over, but it'd be kind of nice. It'd be kind of nice to have some time with, you know, this world, this sea, before we have to start over again and just explore it, you know, and um, see what else there is out there before we have to start over again, which is typically what happens in these early release games. Okay. Is there anybody else? 
house in the immediate vicinity that's going to give us a hassle. There's a guy right here. Take him out. I think that might be it. There's a guy up there. Saw some movement over that way, but I guess not. Okay, I think we're relatively clear. And if we do have a couple stragglers, then of course we have the um, the turret that we can use. So let's head on back here. Flip this guy around. I also want to um, take and put this more in the middle, I guess. Probably doesn't make that much difference, but we'll do that anyway. There we go. So since we picked that up and reset it, we're going to have to, once again, tell it not to be hitting predators. And let's actually turn it off too, and I'll just control it myself if we need to, to do so. That, because we don't have a whole bunch of ammo left, so I don't want to waste it all. Okay, what do we got here? I see blue right down that way. This is a large deposit, so we're going to get some good ore out of this thing. I guess we can just start punching in right about here-ish, I'm thinking. It should then. I'm hoping this will give us enough ass to last for the rest of the build. But we know where to come if we need more, I'll tell you what. The planet was pretty much a jackpot. The only thing that would have been better is a, is a moon instead, so we didn't have to worry about the ground patrols, but we can deal with them. They're not that big of a problem, they're just more of a nuisance than anything. camera. finish mining this out and uh, when I'm done I'll bring you guys back right at the end to show you what the, the hall was okay so I'll be right back 
All right, guys, we're back, and I finished uh, mining out that deposit. Had a little bit of trouble getting out of that thing, but uh, finally managed to get the game to let me out of there. It's just, it seems kind of weird. That's not the first time I've sort of been stuck when I shouldn't have been stuck in, uh, in a uh, <clears throat> mined out deposit like that. But uh, we did make it out, and so let's take a look and see what our haul is here. Nope, we want harvest and a cargo box. So we got basically, excuse me, three, three on about three and a half stacks of Zaskozy, which is really nice. And of course, we got uh, some more restroom. We didn't need the restroom real bad, but um, it was that one deposit was nearby, so I went ahead and grabbed it too. So I think that's what pretty much it for this planet for now. Uh, I can definitely see us uh, coming back here in the very near future and uh you know taking advantage of, of more of these ores but uh, anyway thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this episode let's pick this thing up because we are heading back home so yeah the plan will be that we'll head back to our home system a little lag there head back to our home system and then i'm just going to resume work on the capital ship because i really like i said i really want to get that thing done Um, as soon as possible so we can just use it and have fun with it and hopefully have a little bit of time to d explore this world <clears throat> this solar system before you know we have to completely start over all, all over again so anyway hope you guys enjoyed this episode if you did hit that like button and subscribe to the channel uh, stop by and hang out with us on discord if you want to and come and see me on a live stream i do live stream several times a week on twitch you can find the links to both of those places in the about section of the youtube channel you guys have a great rest of your day and i'll see you in the next episode bye bye